Hey folks, how you doing? This is uh, Sherman Hugh from ShermanHugh.tv and this is a test. This is just a test. And uh, right here I have Mitch Cantor with me. Uh, StudioNashVegas.com. Is that right, Mitch? StudioNashVegas.com? Okay. And uh, and we're um, testing. We, I first met Mitch at the uh, inaugural Uvu Day, my Uvu Day event where there were many, um, many, many sessions of uh, uh, six people in a group using Uvu as a video platform. And so we are testing the combination right now of Ustream broadcasting. So Ustream and CamTwist showing my desktop as I'm broadcasting a video interview that I'm using Uvu for, for the side-by-side -side video platform, which is super cool. I mean, it's it, it not only allows you to have great video interview interface where Mitch and I are side-by-side -side instead of picture-in-picture, -picture, but you also get to see, uh, I believe, a better view of the guests rather than the picture-in-picture -picture that uh, Ustream offers the uh, this and so this is just a test and the interesting thing Mitch is uh, that Uvu wouldn't recognize my DVD cam uh, my my camcorder as a source which means I need to set up my laptop a little higher up so that you don't see my uh, the rod but you see the curtain and um, and I, I love the multicolored beast chair too. It's a great look. <laughs> okay, okay. Okay, now the one thing that I have to um, basically take care of is in order for Ustream to record your audio, I need to unplug my headphone from this so the audio comes in here. Okay, so let me unplug. Let me unplug the um, the headphones. And if you're talking now, Mitch, try um, give me a test. Oh, you know what? Hang on a second. Um, let me see here if the audio device is. Uh, output uh, testing. Okay, uh, built-in mic. Am I wanting a built-in mic? Probably not. I want a built-in input. Can you see my desktop? Okay. Um, testing. Testing. Okay. All right. So, are you also at? Uh, Oh, okay, okay. All right. So, in order for my viewers, let me raise it. In order for my viewers to, on Ustream, to, to hear you, um, can you hear me, Mitch? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, good. So, now the volume from my laptop will push your voice to my mic. And hopefully this will capture your voice also. Um, wow. That's interesting. Hold on a second. You, um, you may want to look into getting a male-to-male -male headphone adapter. That way you can plug straight in to your line in. Coming from this laptop to the mixer, is that right? Yeah. Like instead of instead of having to broadcast it over audio, just line in directly from your source to your microphone jack on your laptop. But the source is um but you're the source here on a laptop. Hmm. So the output here will have to go to I'm just trying to figure out. So the audio source 
on Ustream will actually have to be would it be DV audio right right now it's built-in input so the built-in input mm -hmm. is picking up the audio from my podcast mic and I believe my settings with you on Uvu for audio is built-in input too so it's actually grabbing the audio from the podcast mic also I don't know if that's gonna affect it. I don't know if that's gonna affect it or not but it'll be interesting to to play this back and I can see the volume controls going the VU meter going up and down as I'm talking right now so obviously my podcast mic is picking up my, my voice and I'd like to see if it's picking up yours so I'm, I'm gonna be quiet you go ahead and talk Mitch and I'll see if it'll pick it up sure um, you know this is oh, I'll just do a micro, quick microphone test for you but <laughs> well I'll tell you what, Mitch, really sure what why don't why don't you share with me uh, the highlights of the latest event that you were at that we were talking about that you were participating in I'm not sure the name of the event sure. now go ahead and give me some highlights about that event yeah we were um Oh, I was actually a friend of mine. We went up to Pod Camp, Ohio, up in Columbus. Um, there was a lot of people there, and they were, you know, it has such a it has such a huge new media following. It's it, it's kind of cool to see how many people were there. Um, of course, I did sessions on WordPress, which was kind of it's what I usually do sessions on. It's sort of my specialty. But that's um. You know that's 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 what happened. I mean, we just went up there and we got to chill out with a lot of, of cool people. Uh, Angelo Mondado. I got to meet uh, Gabe Taviano of GodsMac.com. Uh, a lot of the guys from Blueberry and Raw Voice were there. They were one of the sponsors. So I, I got to meet a lot of really um, interesting people up there. Um, got to meet. Mitch, you're cutting out. Brandis uh, from okay. them, but I mean, it's just it, it was refreshing to see so many people in one spot who were passionate about the same topic. So, I mean, even even PodCamp Nashville was good, but it you're cutting in and out, Mitch. I'm not sure if you can hear me, but uh, the feed from your end is pausing. It could be the fact that you're using a wireless um, connection from your patio. It was a link, so we really could. <laughs> wow. Could it be because you're wireless? I'm lagging really bad over here. I don't know what's going on, but... Okay. It's probably me. It's my internet connection horrible here. Yeah, because I think if you're wired, it may be a little different situation. But this is good, though. This is a good test to know if it can broadcast from Uvu to Ustream. And in an ideal situation, it would work beautifully. Uh, the viewers will see you and I picture uh, side by side picture in a, in a wonderful way. Mm -hmm. um, audio, I gotta work it out. I'm gonna listen to the audio recording and, and see what what happens. But um, okay. what I see because the, the beautiful thing is uh, if you combine it with Ustream well, then there's an audience available to type questions in uh, and ask you know ask what they want to ask whereas with Uvu it gives you a beautiful video interface but there's no bro there's no audience you know that that can participate in it so mm -hmm. but it's a little choppy uh, I have to say um, yeah it's it's kinda weird on my end number one I have to mute it just so I don't sound like I'm echoing really badly so every time I talk I actually turn my speakers off um, but sometimes it's re really choppy and it looks like you've just got like a water hose and you put a kink in it 
and then you unkink it, and then all of the, the sentences you said in the last two minutes came out. So it's sort of, no, it works okay, but it's sort of lagging. Yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, buddy. That's great. Thanks for thanks for helping me out with this test. And uh, I'm going to end problem. this recording now. Of course, this is uh, this is Sherman Hugh with ShermanHugh.tv. We have a weekly show. Uh, 11 o'clock in the morning Pacific time, 2 p.m. Eastern, 7 p.m. UK. You can find out more at shermanhugh.tv. It's our half hour huddle. And check out Mitch Cantor. Uh, he is available for kick ass design work with WordPress and blogs and everything else. So check it out at studionashvegas.com. Peace. Catch you guys soon.